And we're back to learning GIMP and this time I'm going to show you how to use the curves function to edit your photos. It's more like an intro, but it should be enough for 99% of the users, especially when you're a beginner. Let me copy this layer because I like to work on a copy so that I have the original in the back end. Make sure the copy layer, in this case the curves layer, is active. And then go up here to colors and you will find the curves option. There are no presets by default, but you could add some and click on the plus sign and then give them a name and they would appear on the presets. By default, it looks like this. And we want to work on value first and use the smooth curve type. You can change it from linear to logarithmic, stuff like this. But for beginners, I recommend just resetting it all. So click on this button and then you can start there. Don't use the freehand, it's a little bit more complex, as you can see right here. We'll switch to smooth and reset it once more. And this is where we start. You can see these two scales at the bottom and on the left hand side. And it goes from black to white. From left to right is black to white. Let me add a dot right here and if I drag the curve on the right hand side down, I'm going to affect these light parts. So this is what this scale indicates. The left hand side is for the dark parts and the right hand side is for the light parts. And the same way the scale goes from bottom to top. So look at these dark parts in the photo. Let me add another dot right here with the left click and if I drag this up I can make these dark parts a little bit lighter. A good place to start is always an S-curve. So you drag this part, let's say at around 25% a little bit down and at 75% you drag it a little bit upwards so that you have this S-shape for your entire value channel. And you can see if I toggle the preview on and off that we have more contrast now and it looks way better. In the same way you can target the different RGB channels, so you can use red, green and blue in this drop down and that way you can give these different parts of the photo a darker or lighter color. Let me start with green right here. And you can see if I drag it up on the left hand side, the darker parts, they get a lighter green. Let me adjust it a little bit like this. You also have a couple of blue shapes, the trees for example. Let me pull it a little bit down for the darker parts. And I'll raise it a little bit for the lighter ones. And now the photo has a completely different feel. Don't forget to confirm it. And you can see with this curves, you can edit your photos very quickly and you can completely change the feel of it. And this is how you can use the curves function to edit your photos in GIMP. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.